hey guys welcome back to my channel so today <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and film what's in my bag and this little cutie actually let me grab some chapstick real quick um i've actually been in her for a couple days Where'd my chapstick go okay um been in her for probably about five days maybe oh i guess i must have put it in the wrong pocket after i got some mints um, I think I've been in her in about five days. I showed you guys the um, unboxing of her and talked about how I wanted to use her over my um, Brenna bag. That bag is up for sale. If you haven't checked out that video, please do. She is gonna be up for sale. I haven't taken her pictures yet to post her on Macari because we had a really busy weekend. We already had plans um, planned, but this Nelly tote is a go. So the Brenna is up for sale and up for grabs. If you would like to get her um, for closer to retail price than the hiked up price I have to do to sell her on Macari. Um, so this is the Dunienberg Nelly tote. This is in the hydrangea print in the cream color. On the front here, I have this cute little palm charm with the bracelet attached to it. It comes just like that from the beauty supply store. And it does have a little zipper on the side with a white zipper track that opens up. I have a Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer in there. And then on the other side, I have this cute little key fob that I showed in the Dooney Hall. It does say Dooney and Burke on it in a pretty pink color. Um, then of course you have the gold Dooney and Burke plate. The tote does have, try not to spill my stuff. It does have feet on it. This is what she looks like from the side and then the back. She is heavy <laughs> and then the other side. So let me put that back the way that it was. I do love, love, love the braided straps. They are very comfortable. The bag is a little bit heavy. So of course, you know, it's not as comfortable as a bag that's not heavy. Um, but you know, when you add your stuff, things do get heavier. Plus I have my planner in here. Um, so she is a little bit heavier. And I'm gonna tell you guys a little story about a little bit of her weight. I don't really think it was her. I think it's just the item, just it ran its course is really what I think happened. But we're gonna go ahead and get inside. I'm gonna grab this pillow off the couch here and see if we can, yep, that should be perfect. All right, so as I stated, my planner is tucked in the side here. I know I still owe you guys a flip and I honestly want to switch covers, um, but I haven't filmed the flip yet, so I have not um, switched covers yet. So this is my personal size planner. Uh, this is what she looks like on the inside. I don't have a lot going on over here. I do have the fly leaf in the front. And then after that, I do have my current dashboard, which just says Lady Boss, a woman who makes her own damn rules. I ordered this planner cover off of did this one come from Etsy or eBay? I can't remember, but the seller was so nice. She included this actual um, dashboard in here. It's like an actual dashboard behind it. And then this is kind of like a piece of vellum that I laid on top and I clipped on here with this really pretty purple heart shaped paper clip that I got from my bag sis Shonda for my birthday. So I will show you guys a flip in this another day. Um, tucked in the back, I do have my stickers that I usually keep on the go with me. And then a, of course, a super cute Villa Beautiful purple pen in the corner. So my planner is in there from, you know, using it. Are you recording? Yeah, what's up? Oh. What do you need? Huh? What do you need? Uh, I want to buy some stuff, but I don't have money on my green bag. Ugh, then you ain't got no money. So no, back to what's no, in my I purse. Have, have we'll money. do the back pocket first like I normally do. Next, I have my lotion. So I have the champagne toast. Lotion is the current one that I am carrying. It's kind of hard to see because it's such a pretty baby pink color, but it smells so good. I have my six key holder, which I use all the time in the black or noir it's from Louis Vuitton. I have it hot stamped in the corner with my nickname. And then I just have car keys, all my keys, driver's license, carry license, all that fun stuff in the side. I have a Jergens lotion, like a travel size for the family to use have my chapstick which is a rose scent I normally change my chapsticks with my bags to make everything match but I've realized that some days I want to switch bags but I don't want to do all the work of switching everything over including like my cell phone case and my cloud color and my um you know airpod case there's so many things I like to change but then a lot of times I just don't feel like doing all that so I'm about to start keeping some of my stuff real simple so that I'm not um what's the word, like discouraged with wanting to go in and switch bags. I do have my um, pink flashlight from the Dollar Tree. I love this thing here. 
I have my AirPods. This is the AirPod third generation in this cute little case I got from Amazon. And then the pearl chain I'm using is from Sheen. I've been keeping this pearl chain on here because it's slimmer, so it takes up less space in the bags. When I carry larger totes, then I can carry my larger um, wrist strap, like the Victoria's Secret one. I just didn't change it when I switched in the bags. Like I said, I'm starting to keep some stuff, some simple. So if I feel like switching, I'm gonna switch. If I don't, I don't. Still working on emptying this tiny little CeraVe lotion. I love the way that Jergens lotion smells though. This little cutie patootie came in an Ipsy box. It's just a tinted lip glow or, you know, little chapstick. It's really tiny. Um, applicator kind of just looks like so. It's like a light reddish pinkish color and actually smells good too. Then I have my white Villa Beautiful pen. It's really a baby pink, but it looks white in the bags. That's why I've been using it in all my bags as my kind of quick grab ink pen. <laughs> Then I have some brush strips. Y'all know I love these. The Equate brand works just fine. And then I have my bag holder in here because she's gonna have to go in the trash. I've been showing this thing since the start of my channel, but I went to hang this Nelly on the corner of the table at the meet and greet mini family reunion that we went to yesterday back in my husband's hometown. And she fell right apart. Like I never even really got my hand all the way completely off the bag I think the full weight of the bag was on the clip but I hadn't let go yet and yeah she she snapped so the little piece right here is a no-go so I am gonna have to find a new one um, Shonda and I were talking about how sometimes some of the tables that you use like at some of the restaurants the table itself is like really thick and you can barely get these on here so I want to find something that is a little longer or a little larger so I'm in the market for that if you ladies have one or know of one definitely hit me up on Instagram and um, you know send me the link or of course you could comment down below as well this is my taser or stun gun whatever you want to call it it is from Amazon and that back pocket is empty and then the slip pocket I don't have anything I was just slipping my cell phone in there as we were you know out and about in the center here, I have this cutie that I got a couple, well, maybe like early last week. Um, it currently has this charm on it, but I'm waiting on the smaller zipper pull charms that I like to use to come with my sheen order. But this is a chalk color or cream color coach signature. It's got the raised C's all over it uh, with a gold zipper from the coach outlet I did pick this up for Bakari I really wanted to do a couple different setups and realize quickly that I don't have enough colors or neutral colors of these to do the setups that I would want to do and I'm addicted to using this as a lady pouch like it just works it absolutely just works so in here is just that my lovely lady products so extra tissue should I need to use them someone commented and asked me about the amount of tissue that's in here saying that this is not enough it's not gonna be enough to clean that the stall really doesn't have enough tissue so forth and so on and I did respond to her comment but I also wanted to mention it in the next video just in case anybody else has also been wondering the same thing I have a habit when I walk into a stall in, in public, initially I check, of course, the cleanliness of the toilet, that there's not literally pee and poop on the side where I'm supposed to be sitting. Number two, that there is tissue in the holder, and number three, that the back of the door has a hook on it. I just scan for all three of those things really instantly, and then close and lock the door and go about my business. Um, and so I don't generally use a stall that does not have tissue. So that's why this has been in a million what's in my bags. It's yet to be used because I generally will come right back out of that stall and go in another one if that stall did not have tissue or some of those other things I just mentioned, like a hook on the back of the door because I'm not gonna put my purse on the floor of a bathroom in public. I absolutely will not. I also will not sit on a toilet in public. Um, I hover, my thighs, they burn sometimes, but I hover. I will not sit on a public toilet, but I'm also not gonna hover over pee and poop either. So that's why I'm not gonna use it if it's on the rim. But anywho, let me get off my rent box. <laughs> my tissue pack is slim because I don't want my lady pouch to be too fat. This is in a dire emergency just in case. Um, or if Jazz or Mally happen to be in the stall next to me and it doesn't have tissue, I can easily hand this under the stall to them, but I'm generally not gonna use a stall if it doesn't have tissue in it. Um, this is a larger size sheen pouch. I would consider this a medium size. It's larger than your standard credit card gift card size. It's got a lady wipe in it. Then I have another sheen pouch. This is the smaller one that holds um, like credit card size. I have floss sticks and some Q-tips and this came in handy rolling down the road. Hubby needed some. 
for our trip over the weekend. I have some soap sheets from Shop Miss A. This is a rose scent. They smell so good. Then I have a little moist towelette. I actually don't have any lady wipes in here because I used <laughs> them over the weekend and I need to refill them. So it is out in here, but my travel weekender bag, of course, has backups in there. It's just, I used the very last one when we stopped at Bucky's on the way home last night. Um, I have two of those expandable washcloths and then I have the tiny bathroom spray which as you can see is half empty so I do need to put some more in there and that is everything that's in there. The two credit card pockets don't have anything on the side so that is everything that's normally in the lady pouch. I'm just going to put the little stuff back in there. Move that out the way. Next we have my wallet. This is the matching Continental wallet. I absolutely love this wallet. I remember when I first got the hydrangea print i really wanted the small flap wallet and it sold out before i could decide cream blue or black and i remember being so salty about it for a couple days even though i had already ordered this one and it was on the way with the bags but in hindsight i'm glad that happened because i ended up not liking the small flap wallet so update the coach the coach get it together layla even if you hear Madly yell in the background i'm sorry he's in my room on the vr and he gets very excited on that game um i'm the coach, Layla, really? The Dooney. The Dooney and Burke satchels that I showed you guys in my most recent Dooney haul where I showed that um, teal color, which I want to say was called Spearmint. Um, and then the chalk or cream, I think it was called... Oh shoot, I don't remember what it's called. Anyway, and the black one, those three satchels. I had ordered the small flat wallet in that spearmint color to go with that teal-ish spearmint color. And I did move into her right away. I did carry her for about a week and I just did not like the small flat wallet. It's very bulky. Um, it does not stay slim like the Continental wallet does and it does not stay slim like the um, Coach Win wallet does. It actually gets pretty fat and pretty pregnant. Um, kind of like the Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet does if you fill her up. So I did decide to send her back. So just to update that um, small flat wallet that I showed in a recent haul from Duty and Burke and that spearmint color was like a teal jade-ish looking color. I did send that back and I'm just going to use my Coach Win wallet anytime that I carry that back. But this Continental wallet I do like. The only thing that's not my favorite about it is because we switch bags so often, make sure guys tucked in, uh, we switch wallets often, we switch details and SLGs often. The card slots sometimes are tight when you first get it and they take time to loosen up. But when you switch bags as often as we do, you don't necessarily get them as loose as you would need them so that you're not struggling to get your card out. So I do struggle a little bit to get these cards out. The top one is easier, of course, because it's at the very top. Um, but other than that, I love this wallet. I've got a couple of receipts from over the weekend for me to scan. Tucked in here, I just had the coupons and the gift cards I currently have behind here. I just have health insurance cards and a couple extra credit cards and debit cards. And then in the back pocket, I just had a little bit of cash. So I just need to scan these into fetch, but this was the wallet that I carry and it does match the bag perfectly, which I love. So we have wallet. And then next on that same side, I have this cutie. I've shown my other one. I have two of these. I showed the other one before. It's got a cute little camera um, charm clipped onto it. I use it as what I call my YouTube pouch and I keep all my, you know, camera editing, YouTube things in there. But I did buy two so that I had one I could use in my purse. So this go around, I decided to use her. I thought she looked very pretty with the lighter shade pink flowers that are in the bag. So it does say adorable on it twice, which I love because that is my middle name. So inside I just have a bunch of cuties and I did want to show you guys this I forgot about it and didn't pull it out in that most recent haul video I did the Sheen and Vicky's haul this is a really cute really thin oh my god thin I really need them to come out with the Layla purple or maybe even a white so it would go with everything or a gold but they only had a pink and I want to say black and so I grabbed the pink and I didn't get the black it is just a mirror just a mirror look at that look at my camera ain't she pretty but just a mirror and it's super thin. It's even thinner than the one that comes in some of the Victoria's Secret bags. So I really love this. I love how it slides out really easily. Like I said, I wanna get this in um, a neutral color that I can use in all my bags, but for now, pink it is. And of course I would love a Layla purple. So I have that mirror. Then I have my cuticle oil from Shop Miss A. I showed this in a previous video. I picked this up while I was in New Mexico at Besties Mall. They happen to have some. I'm still on the hunt for trying to find this, what I'm calling lip topper lip gloss. This is by NYX Professional in the color That's Fire. It came out around Christmas in one of those gift sets and I just have not been able to find a replacement for her. So if you ladies find it, let me know. Let me move this before they fall. 
Um, I have a mascara for on the go. I have my artificial tears. I have my Kylie Jenner lip gloss. This one is the damn Gina. Love this one. I have my favorite lip liner from Juvia's Place and Scorpio. I have my little pill case from Sheen. I'm still waiting on the other ones that I ordered to come in to try out that whole if it's closed, if it's open mess. Inside it does have a little mirror. And then of course I have some pay meds in there. I have a Fenty Beauty lip gloss. I think this one is Fenty Glow. Yep, because it's orangey looking. This is the pinkish looking one as I like to call it. It's another Fenty Beauty lip gloss. And this one is in Fussy. And again, I apologize for Mally. He's having a great time by himself. This is a NYX lip um, liner. This is in the color Coco. I alternate between this one and the Juvia's Place, but the Juvia's Place is definitely my favorite. I still have the Euphoria perfume in here. Haven't switched it out yet. I have my reddish but clear lip gloss from Juvia's Place in the color, what is it, So Ruby? No, Ruby Rose. Let's see if I can get it to show. A little hard to see, but Ruby Rose. I have my Tiny Sheen bottle with some Tatcha face cream in it. I have my NYX Butter Gloss Lip Gloss. I love this one. I got mine from Amazon. Miss T sent me some, but I love this. It's Strawberry Cheesecake is the color. I have a cloud, it's just white, helps me open my Happy Mail on the go. I have this cute little nail file from the Cream Shop. I got in Love Mail from Shonda. I have a purple nail file that I found at, I think TJ Maxx or maybe Ross. I have purple tweezers, an extra hair tie, ponytail, scrunchie, whatever you want to call it. Uh-oh, <laughs> vouch just sliding around. What is that, Lint? Or did something spill? Looks like it's just lint. Yeah, it is. It's just two pieces of pink lint, which is weird because the outside is like a shiny material and the inside is a wipe. It's not wipeable. It's a soft fabric material. But anyway, completely empty pouch. The last thing in there is just my iWalk charger, which I did get from Amazon. I love this baby. And those are all of my catch-all items. So that back area is completely empty. There is a metal zipper in here. I just stuck some flat things. Um, that sometimes I usually would have in my catch-all pouch, like my Too Faced uh, mattifying powder. This is the mattifying powder that I use for um, when I'm sweating or when I am wearing makeup and I start glowing. Um, this is a tiny uh, snap pouch from Dollar Tree. In here, I just keep an extra pair of contacts should I need them. And what else? I have my little first aid pouch. This is just a little credit card size sheen pouch it's clear with glitter and i just have first aid things in it like wipes band-aids um meal scorn things of that nature i have the tags to the bag i have started writing when i remember the price that i paid before taxes on here so that i do know what i paid versus what it's you know currently costing on the site but this is the nelly tote small but it's written right there nelly tote and then it says cream right here so just the tags to the bag is tucked in that pocket and I'm gonna put them back in there because I wanna keep them there. And then on the other side of that separator in the center, I just have my Coach Retail Boutique um, sunglasses case. I love this T-Rose on the front so, so much. And so this is what she looks like from the side and back. I love how it does say coach on the back, which I was slow to learn. I didn't even realize it when I first got it that it was there. And on the inside, it's a burgundy color and I do just have my favorite um, Layla Purple shades in there wearing those still so those are my sunglasses and then I have the matching coin pouch to the bag this is in that hydrangea cream print as well from Dooney and Burke I don't have anything tucked in the back I don't have anything in the front zipper and on the inside I'm just using this as my candy pouch I didn't really have another use for this pouch so I thought well instead of a kiss lock this go round, I will use this as a candy pouch so I have some candy in here which I am tempted to eat because I have a little sweet tooth that I can feel coming on right now. Um, not sure where that little strand came from. Uh, next I have my pin pouch. This is the um, clear pouch or sort of clear from um, the planner spot sub box. It says every day I'm plannering on here. I do have my bag sister charm that I have with my tripod bag sister Shonda and Michelle and on the inside I just have some pink pins and my travel whiteout from Vic. So we have pink lipstick pin from Sheen which is a ballpoint that glides so nicely. We have this cute gold pin with the crown that I did get from Shonda and Love Mail. I have my pink mild liner. 
I have this cutie I got off of Sheen that's pink and kind of ombres into yellow. I love the bow on the top of that one. Two tool pins, a pink one and a white one. So pink ink and blue ink. And then two Villa Beautiful pins. One has purple on the inside, which doesn't exactly go with the bag, but it was the, the purple barrel, excuse me, the pink barrel that I thought looked really pretty with the bag. And then this one is a pretty pink with lighter pink stones in it. So two Villa Beautiful pins. And that is everything in my pen pouch this go round. Oops, get it to zip up. Pen pouch. And then I have my little planner. This is my pocket size planner. It's also known as an A7 in the planner streets. This is a VDS cover. It's fine gray cocoa right. with the brown Napa trimming. I do have a cute light blue pen in here to kind of go with the bag. Because if you notice, it does have that light blue flower in it. So I tried to bring that color out any way I could. So just my usual goodies in here. I know there's a glare, but essentially this is my on-the-go planner. So it's just got an inbox, a little pocket folder, which sometimes I put receipts in there, um, a couple of dashboards and acetate vinyl, and then of course three dividers for notes um, to buy and must do, and then some page markers at the top. So this is my on-the-go notebook and jot down any appointments I might book, shopping list, things of that nature. And then you have your key keeper in here, which I'm not using. Um, the last thing just loosely in the bag is going to be this little cutie patootie. This is a um, tissue pouch that the Novel Crown made me. She is on here. Her name is Tiara. If you have not checked out the channel Novel Crown, definitely do. In the front, I just have a couple tissues for my nose. And then in the inside, which I need to refill because I've had to give Mally a couple lately, is some cough drops and an extra uh, couple pieces of candy just as backup. So I'm actually going to leave this open and place that up there by my phone because I really need to get some more cough drops in there. And then the two slip pockets on the side, just two small things in each one. One of them has the Icebreakers Duo Watermelon Mints. I need to make sure this is on the grocery list because I love that flavor. And then the other pocket, I have my new QR code um, business card for my channel and Instagram. So it just says Layla, aka Just One SB, and you have the QR codes for Instagram and YouTube. It's the same on both sides. It is on a white background with Layla Purple writing. And then I have this really cute. Um, charm on it that I did get from Bestie with her silly self. Love, love, love that. So that is everything, ladies and gentlemen. Um, all the pockets are empty. I love how the inside of this bag is not red. It's this beautiful linen uh, material in this pretty cream light color. This was a great carry. Like I said, this bag is not super light, empty. So you add your things in it. It can be a little bit weighted, but these leather straps were very comfortable on my shoulder. They did not dig in. They did not cause me any problems. And honestly, the weight felt just as normal as my other bags when I put the kitchen sink in it. So really great Carrie. I really love carrying her. I love her. I'm glad I did um, make the decision to grab her and get her while she was on sale. And again, my Brenna is up for sale. I don't have the sticky near me, so I don't remember what the price was. I may pop that on the screen for you guys. Um, I did the math on, you know, what I paid and shipping and all that stuff so yeah definitely enjoy carrying this cutie i'm gonna go ahead and switch into another bag and then of course as more of my um layla purple items come in from coach i would definitely be carrying those and you know showing you guys what's in my bags and those bags as well so thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate all of you um i love how you guys love my channel and love my videos i love all of y'all thank you so 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 much for your love and support and i'll see everybody in the next video bye